Kiosk Cafe, a new stand and coffee bar created by Monocle, has just opened in London's Paddington. Developed as a sunny, optimistic rebuttal to the mistaken narrative that people aren't buying print products, Kiosk Cafe draws inspiration from the city street kiosks of Europe. We bolted together two concepts that we, we all love, the great kiosk and the great cafe in the city. Uh, of course, we've played with um, a K for cafe, so uh, it has maybe a little bit of a nod to middle Europa. Uh, in, in that sense, it should feel like a good newsstand that you might find uh, in, in Vienna or you know, a city in northern Italy. Kiosk Cafe aims to set a new standard in print retailing, providing a catalogue of print-on-demand newspapers ranging from Argentina's Clarín to Czech Lido Veno Vini. Customers will be able to order in advance or simply wait while the title prints out. And in store, an evolving list of the 300 best newspapers and magazines from around the globe will share shelf space. We want to be absolutely a platform for the great and established titles that we like from all over the world. We need to be a platform for young journalists, young editors who want to get their titles out there. But it's going to be a curated experience. Uh, we're going to have a committee who are going to be looking month in and month out um, at the titles uh, that belong on our shelves. And they don't, they don't always have to be a sure bet. If someone's doing a great job and you know, maybe it's not going to be the biggest runaway success, uh, but it's got great photography, or they're doing amazing reportage, then it's going to have shelf space at Kiosk Cafe. Kiosk Cafe will also offer customers all-press coffee and snacks across a wooden coffee bar. With travellers in mind, essentials available for those out on the road include toothbrushes, shower gel from Trace, shampoo from Rausch, pens from Karen Dash, and underwear from the White Briefs. One of the great things about the debut of Kiosk Cafe is its location. We are across the street from the Frontline Club. This is the home for Frontline Correspondents. Of course, London is one of the biggest centers uh, for, of course, foreign correspondents from all over the world. We're across the street, but also we're, in a way, almost the lobby for a whole extension of, of new bedrooms that they've added to the club. We're about 250 steps from Paddington Station as well. So we wanted to be a bit of a refuge for people to be able to meet in the morning uh, before they you know, jump on the train to catch their flight, uh, or likewise uh, when, when they come into town. Created, developed and designed by the team behind Monocle, the business sits under parent company Wincor. It will be a neutral space with the objective of making the whole print sector shine. London's first kiosk cafe has been designed as a brand laboratory location with a view to expanding and franchising internationally. We want people to, to really feel that this is, is something which is, which is quite indulgent. The logo plays uh, a little bit with the great coffee cup, uh, it also plays with the printed page and it's, it's a brand which really can be sort of deconstructed. And we've created this wonderful face uh, using colons and uh, parentheses. We've played with language um, a lot as well. There's a certain cheekiness. We don't want to, to make it sort of you know, too somber and too po-faced. Um, it's not just a design exercise. Uh, and so that's why copywriting is incredibly important. When we look at the overall color palette, we're playing with sort of three principal uh, tones. One is a very nice salmon uh, element, a little bit of a, a nod to the more serious newspapers in the world. And then we also play with a darker and, and lighter grey. These are colours which are slightly in the monocle world, uh, so again, a slight nod to our brand. Our design team worked with expert Japanese builders Edo Construction in the making of the bespoke furniture. Black Vitzo shelves give a sense of volume and variety, and handsome Dinesen solid oak flooring add a coziness to the space. Outside, the cafe's large windows are shaded by a signature black and white striped awning, and the outdoor furniture has been sourced from Swiss brand Manufact. We want a really welcoming, inviting um, environment, and we want this to be part of any community where we happen to be. And so we think Kiosk Cafe works great in, in a neighborhood format, but over time it's going to evolve and Kiosk Cafe can also exist in an airport concourse uh, or it can exist uh, on railway platforms. We really see this as, as almost a kickstart. It's, it's a new era in many ways for what magazine retailing can be.